This is the world's weirdest bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? So today we're doing another build challenge and we have never really limited ourselves on the budget of our builds. Most of the time I kind of just go crazy with the amount of money that I spend, but today we're going to be trying to do a build under 10 thousand simoleons. I think I'm probably gonna struggle quite a bit with this, but we'll see. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Leave any comments or suggestions you may have in the comment section down below, and don't forget to subscribe. Let's get into it. Okay, so I'm going to be building in the winter again. We're gonna go pretty small with this exterior, obviously, because I want to be able to fit a lot of stuff in there. So actually, before I do anything, I have to set my money to $10,000. <laughs> okay, we are officially at $10,000 thousand dollars this is our limit for the build i'm gonna start off like this and i think this is probably gonna be a majority of the house <laughs> i might put like a bump out up here maybe i'll go like this but that's like three thousand dollars gone oh my gosh that's gonna be difficult Ooh, i can already tell okay and then i want to do actually i might just keep it like long like that and then maybe i'll do the roof there i feel like the roof looks better like that okay <laughs> That costs quite a bit of money. Let me see. If we can't do this upstairs, then we're gonna get rid of it, but I'm gonna try my best. Let's freeze it up. I'm just gonna go with like the cheapest stairs that we have. Obviously, I don't wanna spend all my money on stairs, so there's that. I'm pretty sure the cheapest we can get in the game is $2 per like wall piece. Okay, well, this one is $2, so maybe we will actually go like that. Or I actually really like this. This color is really pretty. Let's try this. I've never used this before. And then maybe for this little side part, we can do something like this instead. That's kind of cool. Okay, let's do that. And then I'll fix this part. This is not the vibe I was going for, but we're kind of just rolling with it. <laughs> just gonna stick some roof trim on there. Maybe I'll actually do black. And then the roof, it kind of sucks that we can't see it, but I'm just gonna do a black as well. And we're going to put a chimney. Actually, no, we shouldn't put a chimney. I forgot what we were doing. We are not doing that. <laughs> I think I'm gonna change our stairs to black. We'll go like that. For our foundation, foundation doesn't cost anything, so we're gonna go crazy with it. And then we need a door, we need a railing for our stairs still. This one is five dollars, so we're going with that one. <laughs> okay, cute so far. Ah, I like it with the color of the snow and everything. Okay, we're gonna put a door. Cheapest ones we have are fifty dollars. Honestly, I feel like that one could work. I might change the color there. We'll see. I'm gonna put down the windows and the cheapest windows we have, let me see, are thirty dollars. No. <laughs> oh my goodness. I can either pick right now. I can pick between having my door fit or my windows. We'll try this and I'll put the same window back there. Maybe we'll go like that for this side. I'll do this one over here. We could use that door instead. Okay, let's do that. I'll pull this back out. Okay, we're gonna try. We'll try and make it work. So this is gonna be the outside of our house. <laughs> okay, I just kind of switched it so that it was not winter anymore because I wanted to be able to do some landscaping out here eventually. So I'm gonna do some terrain paint. I'm pretty sure terrain paint is free. Yeah, it is. So we can pretty much do whatever we want with this. I'm gonna use this one. I'll just like make a little walkway there and then I might also do a walkway to the back. We'll see how much money we have after this. I'm gonna put down some flooring right here, finish off the fence, and then I think we can go inside already. I can change the color of this and then it's black and I don't have to spend any money. I'm gonna maybe have it match my stairs, I guess. There are cheaper fence options, but I'm going to just use this one here just because it matches my railing. I would love to use this. I could possibly like fence around the whole lot with that. But again, getting carried away, I have almost half my money gone. <laughs> so, okay, but we're gonna go inside. You know what I'm thinking I might do actually? Because these are $30 each, whereas this one is $30. So I think I might get rid of these and get one that's just worth $30, but will take up the same amount of room. I do like the longer windows better, but if we're gonna save money like this, why not? <laughs> okay, let's go inside. I wanna try and do a layout. So, ooh, the upstairs is gonna be weird. This is supposed to be my bedroom up here. So I'm thinking if I just put stairs going along this way, we might be okay. Gonna use, again, the really cheap stairs. They're called sturdy stairs, so you know, they, they work. <laughs> wow, that's gonna be a really small bedroom, actually. We're gonna make it work. There is that. This will be the living room area, I think. And then we'll do kitchen. Maybe I'll put kitchen on this side, a little dining room, and then I'll put the bathroom here. This is gonna cut across the window, I'm so sorry. There we go. Okay, we're gonna do bathroom and then it's gonna be pretty open because I don't wanna spend the money on walls if I don't have to. All right, let's put a door for our bathroom here. So again, I think cheapest doors for us are gonna be $50. So we could do this basic one. We could also do this. 
I think I'm gonna go dark color with this build. I'm gonna put lighting so we can see what we're doing. So the normal ones that I go to are these uh, saucer lights that are $150, but I think I'm gonna use these cheap ones because they're 70. They're technically a kid's light, but we'll just shrink them down and you're not even gonna know the difference. <laughs> there we go. I'll put a railing on my stairs up here. Not the most attractive railing we have, but actually I have more options. We could do that, then it at least looks like an indoor one. Or this. Okay, we'll go like that for in here. There we go. Okay. For flooring, I'm thinking the cheapest thing we could do is $4. So I think I might just lay this down for now, just as like, again, like a placeholder. And then I'll do the same thing here. We will probably end up changing this. But for now, this is what we're going with. I think I'm kind of doomed. I, I'm thinking about the fact that I still have to buy all of my appliances and stuff. I don't know where to start. Maybe we'll start with the kitchen. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and buy my fridge. That was only $375. So that's not bad. I actually still have to do my wallpaper. So I'm going to do that. We will get an oven as well and I'm probably gonna go with the super cheap one here it's not cute but we got to do what we got to do in these situations it's either a thousand dollars or 400 and you know this is what we're doing for counters I think I'm gonna use these they're not the most expensive then maybe I'll put my oven here and then a sink here. Maybe I won't use this wall. Maybe this wall can go in the bathroom. Oh my gosh, this one's only $2. Okay, we're gonna do this. What color should I do? And then I've picked these counters. They are, they were like $235, I think. I need to put a sink and then we should be okay for our basics for our kitchen. There you go, good to go. <laughs> okay, let's do the bathroom. Okay, for toilets, cheapest one we can do is this one here. For showers, we could do this, but this one is only a little more expensive and I feel like we should maybe go with this one. I'm hoping I'll have enough money to decorate, oh my goodness. And then we need a sink. We're gonna go super basic. Honestly, if our bathroom isn't the cutest, I won't be that mad about it. <laughs> we still have to make a whole living room, oh no. Okay, let's do the living room. I'm gonna get a couch slash like chair <laughs> it's also gonna be a really strange layout in here i mean this is the cheapest one we have and i guess it matches our color it's not cute doesn't look comfy at all <laughs> i can give them the penguin tv you guys are getting the penguin tv there you go who cares it works it's a tv it looks better than this and it's cheaper Okay, so we're gonna put a lamp possibly back there. I'll squeeze this lamp back there. I'm gonna go upstairs and put a bed. And then I think we've got the basics. All right, cheap beds, what do we got? I feel like I'm doing my rags to riches challenge all over again. <laughs> oh, we already have some things we can't afford. I haven't seen that insufficient funds thing in a while. We don't even have wallpaper up here. Oh no, no, no. Okay, we'll try this for our bedroom. I need a bed. I mean, I guess we could try this one or there's like the brown one or this might be kind of cozy. I'm almost out of money. I have $500 left. I wanna put a little end table or a mirror or something. I put a little mirror back there. Maybe I could put a lamp or a flower or something. All right, that's the basics though. I think we can decorate. This is not cute. Oh no. All right, this plant is only $25 and we use that a lot. So I'm gonna throw that in there. I'm gonna put a rug in the kitchen as well. I don't have any eating area for them. I think I have to add like an island or something. Thing. Oh my goodness, we are so down to the wire. Ah, I'm gonna have to sell some stuff for sure. I have one little stool that I'm using for my table here. I think I can save money using the used things, so let's do that. We'll put the used things. I'm gonna go outside and see if I can save some money there as well. Cause I have like $387, but all I have to really do is well get another chair. Now I have $292. If I only have to decorate really, I might be able to do it. So let's get some, what do I need the most? I need a rug. This is getting tricky. <laughs> Ooh, it's rough. It's, it's not good. I don't know if you can even sit on that chair. That doesn't look overly comfortable. I could honestly probably pull this in. We don't need this much room clearly because we don't have enough items for it. So I'll put this in here. I'll squeeze this stuff over and then we'll push this in and this. I think I'm gonna lose that carpet too. I want to possibly do an island instead over here. Our cheapest option for stools are these. Oh, that's so awkward to work around. Maybe we'll lose this counter too. <laughs> for a rug for back there, maybe we could go like that. Now we have $455. See, look at that. I'm thinking I'm changing it again. I think I could save money if I got rid of that. Only used this and put a couple chairs because the islands were expensive to buy. So let's use this. <laughs> maybe we can turn it, oh my goodness. 
We could put it here. Super weird location, but a location nonetheless. Our couch can kind of possibly go like that. It's not really blocking the door, but it is real close. <laughs> I could even move this in more, I think. Really don't need that much room back there for that kitchen. The only problem is the bathroom. I'm just like moving things around, trying to get some kind of possible way to make this work. Okay, new plan. I think I might put the bathroom over here. I'm gonna move everything outside for a sec. I think I'm gonna move my bathroom actually in here. I'm gonna have so much more room this way. I'm gonna go like this, probably like too much room to be honest. And then I'll put my toilet in here i could even fit like a bath or something but there's that and then i have room for my living room over here hold on this might not be as easy as i thought ah we're cutting off like the window from the door is that okay we can't do that this is the world's weirdest bathroom <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Well, it's functional, so whatever. There we go. That is such an awkward entrance. I'm not even like saving money at this point. It's just weird. Look at that bathroom. Ah! Okay, well, for now, that's how it's gonna be. From here, it doesn't look so weird, but we still don't have a railing on our stairs. That's great. There we go. That's that problem. We have our little dining room table here, and then we can do our living room over here. So I'll bring my couch back and my little penguin end table, and then look at that. Okay, coming along, coming along. We have money to decorate now. Yay, let's do that. So how can I save my life here? What do I have for cheap pictures? We have this, that's $50. This broken jar, normally I'll go for this one, but this broken one, <gasps> wait, this is $0? Why? Thank you. Don't even know where I'm gonna put him. Maybe he can go upstairs. <laughs> This bedroom up here is so boring. <laughs> okay, but this is $25, so I can put this somewhere. Nah, maybe not. That's a little weird to have in your house. Maybe I will just go for my go-to little thing here. I feel like I could splurge and maybe get a bigger table for my TV. We can try that, and then I can put, I can put my little bear down the stairs, possibly. Because I, I feel like that bedroom up there needs some work still, and we're not quite there with the decorating. So I'm gonna put this guy in here. I can put a plant on there with him. Okay, I love my little penguin. The plants are actually not overly expensive, so that's good. I can stick that over there. There's that. I feel like I need more like wall things. This is free. Why are there free things? I'm just gonna go with it. It's just something to decorate, right? I'm. Why not? There we go. <laughs> I wanna maybe also splurge and get rid of my little lights here, but if I can get rid of these two, I wonder if that gives enough light. No, not really. Maybe I'll just put this in the kitchen and I can still keep my little light in here. I've never used this, but I feel like that might be kind of cute in here. I wonder if there's more of a wallpaper that like matches. I wanna use the same one with the pattern, but let's maybe go with this color instead. I think I wanna change my counters and I think that would save me money if I did. So I'm gonna go move my little plant here. We will get rid of that inside counter and I am pretty sure I was using these ones. I think these are gonna be cheaper. They are, yeah, they're like $35 cheaper each. So let's use these. I kind of like the used look on there, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, this is pulling together better. The bedroom upstairs and the bathroom, we're just gonna... <laughs> The bathroom we're just gonna ignore. This room though is pulling together quite a bit. And I have $500 still to spend. So I do wanna add more plants. I'm gonna try and find some cheap ones. Just toss them in here. A lot of the plants are actually way cheaper than I thought they were. Like this is only 50 bucks. So I'll put that one there. That one matches a little more. Maybe this one can go upstairs. Yeah, I definitely wanna change it in here. This looks so sad. Maybe I can afford a better bed now. Instead of the mirror I had, I could maybe go like cheap with that one. I'll stick this up here. This is like 50 bucks. Cute. Good $20 plant on there. Documents over there. That's like $15. Anything I can put on here to clutter it up and make it look like it's been lived in even a little bit. Like we can put this party pack in there. Toilet papers, $50. Are you kidding? You are not getting it. Mm -mm. Sorry, peeps. You can have a towel. It's like the same thing. And this towel at that, because it's cheaper. <laughs> there we go. That is gonna be it for this bathroom. Maybe I'll put a plant beside the toilet. There we go. Sorry, Vivian. She's like, what the heck? I have $99 left to spare. Should I spend it on things in here? or up here or landscaping. I'm actually quite happy with the outside of the house, except for the roof that is sliding off. This tree is only a dollar, so we can put this tree like in the back. We can spare that. It's kind of dying, but so are the other trees around. These are $30. <laughs> they don't even exist. They're so small. I don't, I don't know if we're gonna get landscaping, you guys. We are dying for a rug in here, and I'm scared to say that this might happen. <laughs> it's $40. 
It's that or a bath mat. I mean, it's kind of cute. Okay, we have $58. What can we do with this? I'm looking for the free items again. How come we don't have more of those? Found this and like the Strangerville pack. I guess I can use that in there. Or the shush thing. <laughs> $33. What else can we get? I really wanted to add like landscaping outside. I don't have any money for that. Okay, I kind of just saved myself a little bit of money, but I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to do some changing around here. I'm gonna go like that. I think I need to change my windows now. Oh shoot. We're gonna have to use this one, like for everything. <laughs> oh, it looks so weird. But I saved $235 so we can do landscaping. It's a sacrifice we have to make, okay? The bedroom didn't really have to be that large. We can probably get rid of one of these now because we don't have to light up the whole room. Problem solved. Our windows suck, but it's okay. We're gonna have some bushes. <laughs> this hedge is $230. I use it all the time, that's insane. I guess we're using two of these. Honestly, I'm happy with even just that, to be honest. Now we can afford like a light outside at least. Maybe at least for the top of the house, I'll do different windows like that. I guess that, that gives a little bit of variety. <laughs> now that I have $130, what else could we do? We could put this bunny picture in the bathroom. <laughs> I know, I trust, I know, okay, trust me, it's bad, I, I get it. I switched the light up here to this. I just hate how these hanging lights don't provide that much light, but I mean, I guess for a bedroom, it's not the biggest deal. Downstairs, the lights we have are these two. I guess they can stay like that. I have $80, should I just add more bushes? Oh no, I don't have a sink anymore. <gasps> okay, this can go up here. Who was screaming through this entire video saying you forgot a sink? Oh, imagine I ended this video without a sink. No, I can't afford one. How much is this? $125, okay. What did I just do thinking I had so much money? Oh no, what can I sell? I need more. If we get rid of the outside light that I just put, we can afford a sink. So I think we have to do it. Okay, there we go. Should I change the color of this? I think we're done. I spent every penny of that $10,000. I'm kind of shocked with myself. I can't believe we did it. The house is not that cute, okay? But $10,000 and we got this? Not bad. We'll do a quick little walkthrough. I guess we can go in live mode and let Vivian live her best life in this little house at 3.30 in the morning. So this is Vivian, congrats, you've got a brand new house. We're gonna go inside. Oh, look how cute it looks at nighttime. Very, very small in here, but this is our kitchen. It turned out really cute, it's very warm in here. It looks very warm and cozy. Maybe she likes peace and quiet. She's got her little shush thing. She's going to watch her little penguin TV, yes. Okay, the quality looks fine on there, in my humble opinion. The bathroom, I mean, we're just gonna forget it even happened. I guess I could center the rug, but I think the saving grace in here is honestly the rug. If there was no rug, this would be very, very, very sad bunny picture and all <laughs> and uh yeah so this is the downstairs let's go upstairs just in our little bedroom here again very cozy kind of dark but it's fine there's a lot of windows in here with no curtains so <laughs> it's time for Vivian to get a job we're going to end the episode here let me know what you guys think about this build and let me know if you guys have ever tried to build a ten thousand dollar house in the sims if you have any more build challenges you want to see me do please let me know in the comment section down below and I will try and get to all of them thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video all right guys that's it for today's video if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and leave any comments or suggestions you may have in the comment section down below if you're looking for more build challenges to watch, I will link those down below so you can binge those as well. And don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.